November 23rd, she would have just been eight months years old. I just want her back. I just want her back. Zara was as much a rescuer as she was a rescuee. She was my companion. She loved being around me. She best co-pilot. The Whippet lab mix with floppy ears and snow cap paws was Consuelo Howard's everything. I would tell her all the time, you know, as long as you're with me, nothing bad will ever happen to you. I'll always keep you safe. Consuelo dropped Zara off at a friend's house in West Bridgewater Tuesday so she could run around with her fur friends. But a few hours later, he obviously saw me because he slowed down and he ended up hitting the younger dog, drove over her and then stopped after he realized that he hit something, looked in his mirror, looked at me, and then continued driving. Cheyenne DaCosta had stopped at the intersection to help a neighbor corral Zara and two other dogs, which had escaped through a fence. As she was helping, she says a silver Audi SUV came barreling by. He hit her just right that it snapped her neck because she yelped, and then um, he proceeded to drive over her. Cheyenne wrapped Zara up and sat with her as she took her last breath. He's heartless. What's done is done, and I know no matter what happens, I'll never get her back, and I know this house is never going to be the same without her. Any driver who hits either a dog or a cat and kills or injures the animal is required by law to report it to the owner or to police. Police here are investigating. We're live in West